up? Come on in. I'm not going to say I told you so. But you're going to tell me you told me so. No. But let me make it right. Because I wanted you to tell her. I did not want it to come out this way because I know how it was going to end up if it came out from anybody but you. I know. I'm not even mad at you. I'm mad at myself. I'm saying if you're going to bring the bones in the house, baby, at least clean them off first. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. How's, how's Amber? Is she still mad? She's not talking to me. God. You know, that's, uh, I should... I should have just went with my gut instinct and just not let Chantel work there. I should have just trumped Amber's decision, but she's just got a, a kind but heart. That was a sticky situation, it honey, because you're going against your wife, but she doesn't know you're doing it for her own benefit. You know, that was I, kind of a tricky I, situation. I just thought, like, I've passed that. That girl thought, I. she told me I had a baby by her. I remember. You know? So I'm I never thinking, knew who she was, but I remember, the, I remember you too. Right. Yeah, you try to keep that from me now. See, I see how I always I find out. I, see how I always find out. Because she would have fought her. I know. Back you. then, yes, but I've evolved, Anthony. <laughs> anyway, I just thought, like you know, I, that's in the past. And Amber's always talking about leaving stuff in the past. You know, I thought I left Chantel in the past. But you brought it in the house, baby. You know, and that's the minute she just she was adamant about hiring that woman. You needed to tell her the truth. Then she could have made a decision based on whether she was a good worker or she just didn't want one of your bones in her house. I, I get it. Sometimes it's better to be quiet because it makes everything fine for a while, but it always blows up in your face, doesn't it? Every time. So let, let, let me make this right. Okay, you know that place we went to yesterday? You know, why don't I... Get lunch. I'm dating somebody, you know, somebody new. I know. Who are you dating? I said I was going to be the rich auntie that had cats and, and stuff. But I met somebody, and he's very nice. And he gets me. We're, it's going pretty good. Why don't we do a little double day thing? I'll go get lunch from that spot. We like the food. We'll right. a whole bunch of stuff. You know, I'll spend six figures again. <laughs> and let me come over, and we have a little couple's date, a little lunch date. You know, let me, let me smooth things out. I think me talking to Amber woman to woman... We can get past this. She's got to know that I would never, you know, now no. deceive her or, or do her dirty. I got her back. So let me let me help, okay? All right. Okay. All right. If, yeah. if she's talking to me, by the way. Yeah. Let me do what I do. Let me do what I do. Let me do what I do. Give us some time. Okay. But you do need to check the anger issues. She worrying me kind of that. That's gonna make her great and age, I can tell you. Bye, Bye, Cole.